Spooky 2 Sing 2 Generators for Cancers V1.0 by David Burt The problem with cancer using rife technology to deal with cancer isn't simply a matter of killing cancer cells. There's much more to it than that. Cancer cells produce many poisonous byproducts as they furiously reproduce. When you kill a cancer cell, it's likely to rupture and release its toxic contents. At best, it may retain cell wall integrity until nature and time take over at which point it spills its poisons. So, depending on the extent of the cancer, and the rate at which you kill it, you're going to have countless dead cancer cells in your body, all of them carrying, or leaking, poison. While our healthy cells are constantly dying and being replaced, these are not filled with toxins, and they're not all dying at the same time, so our body systems can deal with this natural process without problems. Dr. Royal Raymond Reif treated his cancer patients for five minutes a day every third day. He limited his treatments in this way so as not to overwhelm patients with toxins from killed cells, and to allow their body systems and organs enough time to deal with the cleanup of the destruction his treatment had achieved. There's a very good reason for what he did, toxic overload can shut down the liver and kidneys very quickly, and it can even kill. So you have to get all this dangerous rubble out of the body as quickly as possible. And you do that by using frequencies to detox. Doing this prevents the pollutants from settling, and keeps them moving so that they enter the bloodstream, the lymphatic system, and the intestines. And this is where the next problem arises. The eliminatory system consists of the liver, the kidneys, the intestines, the lungs, and the skin, but only the first two need concern us here. Even a healthy body would find it difficult and damaging to try to cope with an internal tidal wave of toxins like this, so a body weakened by cancer and the ravages of certain other treatments would be brought under great strain, unless the liver, kidneys, and intestines were actively supported. And then there's the problem of managing the pain of cancer without further poisoning the body. So dealing effectively with cancer isn't just the single job of killing cancer cells. It's actually four jobs, all of them vital, killing, detox, support, and pain control. Prior to the introduction of the spooky to rife system, you'd have had to tackle these jobs one after another. So you would have been sitting next to a machine holding electrodes, not just for a couple of hours as you perhaps believed, but for anything up to eight hours every day, depending on your condition. But, uniquely, Spooky2 offers the extraordinary ability to perform parallel processing. This allows all four jobs to be performed at the same time by using four generators operating in remote mode. Plus you can use one of them daily in contact mode for some heavy duty killing, detox, support, or pain control. So for certain conditions like late stage cancers, Lyme disease, Morgellons disease, and other synergistic multisystem multipathogen illnesses, we recommend using four generators. However, we know that times are tough, and that money doesn't grow on trees, especially when you're unwell. Not everyone can afford the $750 needed for four generators in their peripherals, I get many emails from broke people in big trouble, and this document is an attempt to point them in the right direction. While one single generator is certainly a better proposition than any old-fashioned Rife machine, because you can use it in remote mode when you're not doing contact mode work or while you sleep, it's still a very long and steep climb. However, with two generators, suddenly the task is not so Herculean. If you're willing to spend the time doing a few reasonably short contact mode sessions a day, then switching that generator to remote mode, you can make good progress with all four aspects of the task. This PDF aims to outline how I would personally approach it. Contact versus remote The first thing you need to know is that contact mode isn't intrinsically any more powerful than remote mode, but it produces beneficial effects a good deal quicker. It's been authoritatively estimated that to produce the same effectiveness as one contact mode session, you would need to the apply the same frequencies between 10 and 20 times in a row in remote mode. So a contact session that takes 30 minutes would take between 5 and 10 hours to produce the same effect in remote mode. Since the only real difference between each mode is time, this means that the only settings that need to be changed to switch a killing program from contact mode to remote mode are the repeat values, and possibly the dwell multiplier and reduce amplitude for detox, 
support, and pain only, here and after called healing. Frequency multiplier repeat every freq repeat each set repeat program dwell multiplier duty side amplitude offset phase angle amplitude wobble disabled. Frequency wobble disabled. Reduce amplitude 10 kHz frequency multiplier repeat every freq repeat each set repeat program dwell multiplier duty side amplitude offset phase angle amplitude wobble disabled. Frequency wobble disabled. I5 reduce amplitude 10 kHz frequency multiplier repeat every freq repeat each set repeat program dwell multiplier duty side amplitude offset phase angle amplitude wobble disabled. Frequency wobble disabled. Reduce amplitude 10 kHz contact mode, killing, load JW killing from the program patient name menu, then load the cancer killing set. Repeat each set, one repeat program, one dwell multiplier, one reduce amplitude, untick contact mode, healing, load JW healing from the program patient name menu, then load the healing set. Repeat each set, one repeat program, one dwell multiplier, one reduce amplitude, tick remote mode, Killing healing, load JW killing or JW healing as appropriate, then load the killing or healing set. Repeat each set, 4 repeat program, 0 dwell multiplayer, 1 or 0.33 reduce amplitude, untick contact mode settings The settings illustrated above for killing and healing differ in only one respect, reduce amplitude. Repeats, the values of 1 for killing and healing tell Spooky2 to run the program once, then stop. Dwell multiplier, the value of 1 tells Spooky2 to run each frequency for its default dwell which is known to work. Reduce amplitude, for killing, this box is unticked because the JW killing preset automatically transposes all frequencies up to a level where they don't bite. For healing, the JW healing preset doesn't do this because Rife healing uses frequencies in a different way to killing, so this box is ticked because low frequencies can bite. Remote mode settings The settings illustrated above for killing and healing are identical. Repeats, the repeat each set value of 4 is to allow each set in any multi-set program to be repeated 4 times before the next set, preventing dilution of effectiveness. The repeat program value of 0 tells Spooky2 to continue looping the program until you manually stop it. Dwell multiplayer. The choice of 1 or 0.33 is offered here because many users have found success by using dwells shorter than the default. The result is that the user is exposed to each frequency for one third of the normal time, but is consequently exposed to it three times more often in the same time period. Important users have reported excellent results from using an alternative setting to those above DH Killing Healing. It's used for both killing and healing, and you can find it in the OK. Let's Rife section of the Spooky2 user's guide. Don't make the mistake of packing your program with sets. This makes it difficult to identify which set may be responsible for producing the most beneficial effects, and it also makes it slower to find such sets. It's less effective, too. For example, if you have 6 30-minute sets in your program and one of them is working, this means it's only going to be transmitted once every 3 hours. Allow 3 days to test a set, then try another. Making your own changes JW killing, these are very carefully thought out settings and I can't see any way to improve on them. JW healing, the only changes I occasionally make is to switch the square wave for a sawtooth, and use a value of 20 for the amplitude. Try both, and stick with what works best for you. DH killing healing, when killing, you may wish to enter 64,000 into the field of the frequency limits pain. This raises all low subharmonics into the KHZ range, which is more effective. Points to remember? Before embarking on the main task, it's strongly advised that you first complete the regimen outlined in Appendix A of the Spooky2 user's guide. Subsequent sessions will be more effective as a result. For killing in contact mode, the higher a frequency is, the deeper it penetrates the body, and the easier it enters the cells. You must actively assist in the detox process by drinking at least 3 liters of pure water daily, half of it before noon. This will help flush out the kidneys, and increase electrical conductivity in the body, especially if you add a tiny pinch of sea salt or Himalayan pink salt to your daily ration. In any battle, the more weapons that are brought to bear on the enemy, 
the more likely it is that victory will be achieved. Don't neglect other modalities, especially diet, naturopathic, homeopathic, and herbal. The work of Dr. Bradley Nelson and others has clearly demonstrated that emotional trauma lies at the root of almost every cancer. His groundbreaking book The Emotion Code demonstrates a way to resolve this, and the PDF of this is free to download. Generator 1 Generator 2 Day 10900 Contact Cancer Killing Then, Remote Cancer Killing Loop 1500, Contact Liver Support Then, Remote Liver Support Loop 2000, Contact Cancer Killing Then, Remote Pain Kidney Support Loop Overnight 0900, Remote General Detox Loop 1500, Remote Pain Loop 2000, Remote General Detox Loop Overnight Day 20900, Contact Kidney Support Then, Remote Kidney Support Loop 1500, Contact Cancer Killing Then, Remote Cancer Killing Loop 2000, Contact Liver Support Then, Remote Pain, Slash Liver Support Loop Overnight 0900, Remote Pain Loop 1500, Remote Blood Detox Loop 2000, Remote General Detox Loop Overnight Day 30900, Contact General Detox Then, Remote Cancer Killing Loop 1500, Contact Kidney Support Then, Remote Kidney Support Loop 2000, Contact Cancer Killing Then, Remote Pain Blood Detox Loop Overnight 0900, Remote Blood Detox Loop 1500, Remote Pain Loop 2000, Remote General Detox Loop Overnight Day 40900, Contact Immune Support Then, Remote Immune Support Loop 1500, Contact Pain Then, Remote Pain Loop 2000, Contact Immune Support Then, Remote Pain Immune Support Loop Overnight 0900, Remote Pain Loop 1500, Remote Immune Support Loop 2000, Remote General Detox Loop Overnight Here's a possible 4-day timetable for two generators, both being used for 24 hours a day. Day 4 is devoted entirely to immune system support and pain. On the 5th day, the timetable starts over again. Note that if you don't have pain problems, you can substitute lymph support detox instead. The program's cancer killing, this denotes sets targeted at your type of cancer. You should use an accurate detailed diagnosis to seek matching sets in the database. If none exist, you must do some web research. For instance, there are no sets for kidney cancers. But research reveals that 90% of these are urothelial cell carcinoma, also called transitional cell carcinoma TCC. Further digging shows that this also affects the bladder and urinary system, and is called transitional bladder cancer TBD. And there are several sets for this in the database. Wikipedia is generally good for this sort of research. Don't forget that viruses are also deeply involved in cancers like BX, BI, HPV, and SV40, BXBY. Cancer BXBYCUSTC settings on next page Cancer BXCUST Bacillus X filter Cancer carcinoma rife Cancer BY virus CUST run these three sets as one program with a dwell multiplier of 1.667. HPV human papilloma virus cancer HPV moles and tumors CUST also try other HPV sets if no result. SV40 simian virus 40 Simeon virus 40 and 1 half extra simeon virus 40 and 2 halves extra liver support, run each group of sets below as one program, liver 1 PROV liver 2 PROV liver fluke CAFL liver function balance extra kidney support, run each group of sets below as one program, kidney function balance 1 half extra kidney function balance 2 halves extra kidney insufficiency CAFL lymph support, these are from the spooky 2 users guide, Lymphs and Detox 1 half PROV Lymphs and Detox 2 halves PROV Immune Support, Immune System Stimulation 3 and 1 half PROV Immune System Stimulation 3 and 2 halves PROV General Detox, Detox 4 Toxins Throughout the Body CAFL Blood Detox, Lymph Antida CAFL Streptococcus Pyogenes CAFL Run these two as one program. Pain Cancer Pain CAFL Cancer Pain Extra Also try pain sets targeted at the cancer's body location. Finally, learn from the experience of others, join the Spooky2 forum and ask any questions you have. You are not alone in your journey. Nor are you the first to make it. 
program options frequency multiplier repeat every frequency repeat each set repeat program dwell multiplier amplitude wobble frequency wobble I reduce amplitude 10 kilohertz R to 33 hertz gate I randomized I skip concurrent duplicate frequency remove duplicate frequencies I override pause schedule I prevent global start when one duty side amplitude out 150 20 out 250 20 percent V frequency limits hertz apply more than zero Octal 1 1 offset 0 0 percent 0 C scalar phase angle 0 0 0 apply disabled 0 percent 16 steps frequencies directly JD disabled 0 percent 16 steps do NOT sort frequencies F2 equal F1 X hertz out to control out 2 equal out 1 out 2 equal out 1 F copy gate X1 plus 0 X1 bolts stop when out 1 stops Add FI to F2 waveform 10 spike length ratio BX BY BX BY follow out all spike plus ink inverse plus ink. Count zero cancer BX BY CUST contact. This is an engineered set that should be run alone. For remote use, change the repeat program setting to 135.